Commercial supersonic flight has long been desired to reduce air travel time and improve personal mobility, particularly for today's long-distance travel. However, these benefits have not been realized due to the challenge of sonic boom. When the Concorde was designed in the 1960s, sonic boom was so disruptive to people on the ground that a prohibition was soon placed on supersonic commercial flights over land that remains in effect today. This prohibition created an economic barrier that extinguished civil supersonic aviation. Sonic boom reduction has been pursued for many years, but recently, NASA and its partners have made a number of significant advances that bring the goal much closer. New boom reduction aircraft shaping tools have been developed and validated by analysis, wind tunnel testing, and flight experiments. Partners believe that the time is right to conduct a flight demonstration. To do this, a new X-plane incorporating boom reduction design will be developed and flown. For cost savings, this demonstrator will be smaller than future civil supersonic aircraft, but will be designed to replicate their boom. Flying overhead, this innovative aircraft will produce a soft thump sound in place of the sonic boom. The first phase of the flight research project will validate the low boom design and make an initial assessment of the acceptability of the noise levels. Through cooperation with regulatory agencies and community participation, NASA will use this X-plane for supersonic overflight research, assessing the community's response to the sonic thump. If they even notice. The research generated by this crucial program will create an opportunity to change the rules for supersonic flight, taking a giant leap to the next generation of civilian aircraft and accelerating us into the future, quietly unlocking the freedom to travel around the world beyond the speed of sound.